evening and assalamu alaikum ladies and gentlemen on behalf of IPDA board members me dr Arifur rahman welcome Come in this august at first i express my gratitude those who are present sitting in front of us and those who joined virtually as they have cut their time in this busy schedule and in this holiday we know why we are gathered here it's a very auspicious occasion for us in the regard of educational background. This is the day when we're going to inaugurate our IPDA research and training center. We are very blessed to have our chief guest as National Professor Brigadier Abdul Malik sir, who is the founder and president of National Heart Foundation Bangladesh. We are blessed to have our Professor Abdul Wadud Choudhury sir as our chairperson of this session. Our keynote speaker will be the person whose brainchild is the IPDA Foundation. He is none other than our Mohsin Ahmed sir. He will be the keynote speaker and he will also introduce our board members and other guests. We are very honored to have our special guest that they are the renowned person of the country. Professor Dr. A.K.M. Mohibullah sir, who is the present president of Bangladesh Cardiac Society. Professor Dr. Konokanti Bonura sir, who is the honorable vice chairman Chairperson, Vice Chancellor of Bangamundu Sheikh Mujib Medical University, and Mr. A. M. Aminuddin, Honorable Attorney General of Bangladesh. In this regard, I would like to request Professor Abdul Wad Choudhury sir to please come up on a dais and a few words regarding IPDA Research and Training Center. Thank you, sir. Good evening, everybody, and assalamu alaikum. We are very delighted to announce that IPDA Foundation, which means Interactive Professional Development Initiative Foundation, is going to arrange this program on this day. On this occasion, we express our hearty plaudits to our chief guest, special guests, guest of honor and all the participants who have joined us here in person or virtually. IPDI implies a wide variety of specialized training, formal education, or advanced for professional learning intended to improve professional knowledge. That's the key, to improve the professional knowledge, competence, skill, and effectiveness to serve this country. At the end, all the activities of this organization are directed to develop knowledgeable, skilled, and humane professionals for the 21st century. We'll take this country further forwards. IPTA aims at creating skilled professionals, enhance performing educational activities that serve to maintain develop or increase the knowledge, skills, and professional performance. Participation in professional activities which provide opportunities for candidates to identify resources and engage in activities that develop and expand knowledge and skills through community service. I pay emphasis on that through community service. Service learning, conferences, lecture series, workshops, and training. Another thing is that in Bangladesh, there's serious deficiency in epidemiological information and disease specific database. No country can pinpoint its problem with a research and relevant database. In this regard, IPTA Foundation is going to establish a research and training center for which of inauguration we are here today. This will be a center for excellence for sharing knowledge, improving professional skills, and continuing academic activities. Many distinguished cardiologists, medical professionals, and professionals from other disciplines are participating in this program personally and virtually. IPT Foundation believes that this program will be a successful step towards a valiant journey. We are grateful for your kind presence and it will be a source of inspiration for our future endeavor. Thank you, everybody.
थैंक यू सर फॉर योर लैंडमार्क स्पीच गुड इवनिंग असलम वेलकम टू डेज आई पी डी आई सस्टेनिंग सेंटर इन सेवनी इट इज हिस्ट्रिक मोमेंट फॉर आस बट नॉट फॉर द आवर गेस्ट बट आई रियली ग्रेटफुल टू द प्रेजेंस इन ए कोविड आरा इन दिस पैंडमिक सिचुएशन इट इज रियली really really uh, i think uh, in a pandemic era we are getting together in a situation thank you so much uh, uh, this man is my idol i always uh, did the biography is uh, abul pakir jana labidin abdul abdul kalam every i think every month i read it is his biography uh, always the young people should dream should see the dream but dream is not that which you see while sleeping it is something that does not let you sleep so uh, from the dream uh, you know our father of the nation bangladesh mujib rahman he not sleep 22 years he for life in the jail or tired hard so he give our nation bangladesh you know um, our guest you know uh, brigadier Abdul Malik sir, he is the father of cardiology. He dream build the cardiology in Bangladesh. He built in the Bangabandhu Sheikh Mujib University, past PG Hospital Cardiology Department, then NICBD, then Heart Foundation. So for the young generation, how a man so laborious, so dream came true by his continuous laborious. So it uh, uh, generates the potentiality. How a person he get a stage. our attorney general young person and aminuddin and also our vc vice chancellor he is a extraordinary neurosurgeon he is a tremendous i think so much energetic he come in covid covid pandemic to encourage us in the in our in our uh, center we really sir i am grateful to you sir thank you sir and our uh, uh, leader ak mohibullah sir he is the president of bangladesh cardiology society uh, he is in the, in the i think in the webinar and our expert advisor abdullah shafiun sir my teacher he is also an one philosopher another is the great interventional cardiologist in bangladesh i just pioneer interventional cardiologist professor monit jones sir here he always encourages me he called me on the, on the telephone always phone me and professor wadu sir please go on in the ipdi for the young generation sir we are grateful to you for coming here sir and then then uh, abdul rahman sir uh, he i he's my really mentor how a man so energetic uh, so much brilliant organizer how bit goes in international level uh, is also another is the ridwan professor ridwan rahman sir he is the i i i know him as a philosopher because he is an also not just internist not a clinician he is a philosopher sir is the advisor of our ipdi and our international i think they are also joining him in seven he is the so much gentle humble law, uh, brilliant card international cardiologist but he is the our international advisor and professor tan who came and uh, another philosopher i always i uh, is the on a fan of professor sundeep mishra he is the brilliant uh, philosopher writer clinical researcher he and professor ridwan sir uh, made a scientific module for the young generation in bangladesh i think we start next month a scientific uh, module by the professor ridwan sir and professor sundeep mishra then uh, also another doctor uh, i think uh, shohit a merchant is in mumbai he uh, i think he is also joining the webinar uh, as professor wadus sir said in bangladesh there is serious deficiency in epidemic information database so no country can pinpoint any problem without research and relevant database solving the problem and development is not possible without identifying the problem first so on this background healthy heart happy life organization was formed on july 23 by some research oriented doctors and like minded professionals from different field with the slogan charity awareness and research for humanity uh then hello is formed with my friend here the hello president advocate uh, uh, abu raja mohammad kayum khan and my friend also they are uh, the different professionals the director of civil aviation uh, mr johir and my friend is corporate officer uh, 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 and banker lots of professionals is my friend is here they from the hello so but they give me chance to generate the another professional ipdi is only works on the awareness and research ipdi is the part of the thank you my friend everybody and why uh, we should go for the research constant in bangladesh 
why Bangladesh is be, uh, so much lagging behind research? Poor supervision of the research paper in the academic field. Data analysis is software is knowledge in, in minimum in Bangladesh. Language problem is the main issue. Indicate number of funding authority for research. Scarcity of scientific paper publications. And plagiarism is the most important in Bangladesh. Uh, so how to overcome the constant? More research minded people are needed. So IPDA work on it. We generate the at least five to 10 billion young generation so we can go coming forward. So we IPDA morally produce the young generation in an interactive way. Young generation is the give the um, some uh, issues and we just senior, I am, I am middle aged people, I the beginning between the young and senior person. Research should be in honest way. All points and cons of the research should be learned in early, early stage, should be early stage. Supervision should be played in the part. So we are supervisor should be played the part. We are the busy cardiologist, internist, we should give some time for the young fellows. Authority should be provide adequate financial support. They should have regulatory authority for maintaining the utmost quality of research work. Why professional development is important? Why? Uh, when I work in the Wadusa uh, in the Dhaka Medical College, he is my direct teacher, but in the in Dhaka Medical College, worked with the, we, we always thinking uh, really professionally, we are gradually decreasing in, in, the, in our teacher, in the ideal. Uh, our Kanukande Burasai, Mubila Sar, so much billion professionally active, but our young generation is so energetic. But why they are lagging behind from the professional? Number one, confidence and credibility, efficiency, ability to influence and lead, building network, the achieving career goals, becoming better employee. Our important is that we have to do that. We have to do that. We should hear from the young generation so we can give the professional development. So uh, I just skipped the slide because already uh, what you said tell you something uh, about this. Objectives of IPI, we should awareness program, continuing education, participation in the professional activities, research work, approach to professional development, skill-based training, accomplishment of target assignment, our objectives, more objectives. Uh, uh, what the activities of IPDI? We last one year, we did some research work, IPDI classroom, virtual classroom class, IPDI mid the expert, IPDI Catholic Manual Series, IPDI Catholic Technician Nurses Refresher Courses, Interactive Intervention Cardiology Refresher Course, and Hello IPDI YouTube channel. It is archive. I think it is the biggest archive in Bangladesh. Oh, we do the, some research project. You see, we completed one project with the BMRC, prevalence of metabolic syndrome among Bangladeshi adolescents. We have done some ongoing project, tens of atherosclerosis cardiovascular disease risk factor and outcome among Bangladeshi population. And our recently upcoming project in Chittagong is the screening of the cervical cancer, cancer among the selected governments work in, in Chattogram. We already completed the uh, project with the BMRC and all the, uh, published our uh, research project. And we have some research work here. And ongoing project, uh, doing the project with the Bangladesh uh, Ministry of Health and uh, Science and Technology. This, uh, it is a core study, it's ongoing process. And upcoming project in Chattogram, you see that already we take the ethical clearance from the Chittagong Medical College. We did the IPDA virtual class. Already we finished the more than 40 classes. We skipped the sliders and IPDA meet the expert. Lots of the expert in the internationally reported, Imad Seiban, uh, Professor Sundeep Mistro, Ashok Shet, Dr. Semu Mathias, all the brilliant teachers uh, take the lecture and our great opportunity for the fellows meet with the Indian cardiologist and homeland abroad in a single platform while we did this from the regular academic activities due to the global corona pandemic. Uh, you see the Ashok and also there were lots of learned person take the card. Uh, we, we did the IPDA Catholic Manual Series. The Professor Munit Jaman and Professor Abzal Raman, Fazila Malik, Professor Mir Zamaluddin, our director and ICBD, all, all are in the to the panel list. The expert panel always did the uh, Professor Soyid Ali Hassan in the uh, Bangabundu uh, Medical University Chairman and Professor Meshkatu Dhamed, Professor Khaled Mohsin sir, always, always did the for the fellows and it is a single uh, platform with the covered the A to Z of the intervention coronary peripheral structural intervention device therapy. Uh, that we we did also Catholic technicians because without technician training course, nurses refresher course cannot complete the Catholic procedure. So we did two courses already, one and uh, series one and two. And we in the 13 March 2020, we did the different type of refresher course where the failures are talk, giving talk, they are giving speech, their presentation, but only senior cardiologist moderate the program. It is a different type of arena in the last Corona episode of 13 March we did. After that, no conference is occurring in Bangladesh. We are ready to, we are waiting for another conference in the in the open field in the lively. Uh, it is the 13 March, it's a historic moment. You see the, all the junior doctors are talk and we only, only seniors are moderate the program. 
uh, we have generated Hello IPDI YouTube channel. Here, every all the presentations, programs in channel, just click the channel. You see, uh, type the WW Hello Health and they scroll down. You just click the channel. You see the all the lecture here. More than around 70 lectures there, all the renowned countries in the home and abroad. Uh, it is the, our admin group, uh, the Professor Meshkat Ahmed, uh, Professor Khalid Mohsin, Kaisan Nasrullah Khan, Dr. Monwar, my uh, on the, one other, one other uh, young fellow, Dr. Aifi Rahman, Muthi Rahman, Dr. Tanbir Ahmed. Uh, I, I, our guest of honor today, I think Dr. Professor Subir Rahman in the outside in Dhaka, but in the Zoom, and Professor Mir Jamaluddin, Professor Fazila Malik, Professor Ali Hassan, and uh, uh, um, here, Dr. Robai Tamin is the line director of director of NCDC. Uh, I think IPDI Hello work with him. And Professor Nazmul Islam is the director of uh, CDC control. And uh, our uh, Mr. Moshi Rahman is the ex edition secretary of health and family labor. We have a very difficult to long way to go. Uh, but I think if you are with us, I think we can overcome this the every step. Thank you, everybody. Thank you for coming here. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your valuable comments. Your comments will be will be strength for the young stars. Uh, in the meantime, uh, uh, Professor Robert Evans has joined with us. He recently he, uh, appointed as line director for non-communicable disease control. DJ Health and uh, People's Republic of Bangladesh. Big round of applause for him. Thank you. So in this situation, uh, I would like to request Professor A.K. Mohibullah, sir, Honorable President, Bangladesh Cardiac Society. Uh, sir, please join uh, and say a few words around IPDI, uh, opening of research and training centers. Uh, thank you very much, uh, uh, Chairperson of the IPDI, Professor uh, uh, Professor Ramander uh, uh, Abdul Chaudhary, Secretary General of the IPADI, Dr. Mohsin Ahmed, today's chief guest, our teacher, National Professor Brigadier Malik, the uh, special guest of this session, and the advisors of IPDI as well as the guest of honors of IPDI. It is indeed a great honor for me to be here today in this inauguration ceremony of IPDI Center. I have, by this time, by this time, I have learned from this uh, different speeches that IPI, IPDI has taken, many events, during, even during this corona era for developing uh, the scale of the professional people. And I hope they will continue to do it in future. And by, and through reach, uh, this, uh, and Dr. Mohsin has already uh, projected some problems uh, uh, and the uh, hurdles which are for, which is, uh, which is the hurdle for our research activities. I hope they will overcome it and through different research work, they will continue to develop our professional interactivity and the professional skill will be more developed in our country through these research activities. As well as at the same time, I am thankful to the organizer for inviting me here as a guest and thank you all, and I hope that the IPDI will continue to their work in the future for the development of the professional uh, uh, activities and professional skill. Thank you very much to all. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your valuable comments. Now I'd like to request <laughs> Professor Dr. sir, Honorable Vice Chancellor, Bangabundu Sheikh Mujibur Medical University, to say a few words. Sir, please. <clears throat> Thank you, Dr. Arif. Uh, Mr. Chairman of this session of IPDI Research and Training Center inaugural ceremony, 
ప్రొఫెసర్ అబ్దుల్లోదు చౌదరి జనరల్ డాక్టర్ మోహన్ అండ్ అవర్ చీఫ్ గెస్ట్ ఆఫ్ దిస్ సెషన్ అవర్ రెస్పెక్టెడ్ టీచర్ ప్రొఫెసర్ బ్రిగేడియర్ జనరల్ రిటైర్డ్ ప్రొఫెసర్ బ్రిగేడియర్ మాలిక్ ఎస్పెషల్ గెస్ట్ మిస్టర్ ఏం అమినుద్దీన్ ఆనరబుల్ అటార్నీ జనరల్ అండ్ ఎస్పెషల్ గెస్ట్ మై ఫ్రెండ్ ప్రొఫెసర్ ఎకే మొహిబుల్లా ప్రెసిడెంట్ ఆఫ్ కార్డియాక్ సొసైటీ డిస్టింగ్విస్ట్ గెస్ట్ అండ్ లేడీస్ అండ్ జెంటర్మెన్ వెరీ వెరీ గుడ్ ఈవినింగ్ టు యూ ఆల్ ఐ ఐ బిన్ ఆనర్ టు బి ప్రెసెంట్ ఇన్ దిస్ ఆగస్ట్ గ్యాదరింగ్ i appreciate this interactive professional development initiative for organizing such a wonderful platform for training research and development of skill for our medical professionals not only for doctors but for the nurses and technicians also it is the combined effort of all of us to give a proper treatment to our patients so they have taken the right decision to not only to improve the uh, knowledge and skill of our professionals but at the same time for help they have also taken the initiative to train nurses and uh, technicians i do congratulate them for organizing such a wonderful uh, initiative Uh, i hope this will continue and this will reflect in the improvement of treatment of our patients as a whole i hope uh, we should uh, take initiative from them by learning from them we should take more initiative you say to become a competent physician or a surgeon we need to have a knowledge at the same time we need to have a proper training and they the ipdi is the platform to improve the knowledge as well as the skill of the professionals at the same time they are also taken the initiative for research work which is very important in our country i i hope they will continue and i wish their success thank you very much for inviting me i am i am also honored to be present in this august gathering thank you very much thank you sir <clears throat> thanks a lot you have made this spectacular evening more glorious because in this covid situation you have take all the risk to come in person uh, in the meantime our special guest from uh, abroad uh, dr imad shivan dr merchant already joined with us uh, in this occasion at present moment i would like to request mr am aminuddin honorable attorney general of bangladesh to say few words regarding this occasion okay sir sir please unmute sir Mr. A.M. Aminuddin, sir, Honorable Attorney General of Bangladesh. Yes, can I? Yes, sir. Okay. Uh, sir, is, uh, maybe there is some network problem. So, sir will be uh, joining soon. Uh, in this situation i'd like to request professor imad shivan to say few words professor imad shivan please unmute uh, good evening to uh, to all of you do you hear me yes 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 okay i am really honored to be with you 
and uh, I'm, it is really a big pleasure for me uh, to co cooperate with uh, uh, with the, all my colleagues in uh, Bangladesh. Uh, I think uh, the uh, experience exchange uh, promoted by your organization is absolutely essential to proceed uh, in uh, more and more in interventional cardiology is useful for not only for young people, but also for old people like me. I'm every time learning something and I hope to continue this cooperation. Thank you very much for the inv invitation. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thanks for joining. I'd like to request Mr. A.M. Aminuddin, sir, Honorable Attorney General of Bangladesh. Please join, sir. Assalamu alaikum and very good evening to all of you. Uh, this is a great pleasure for me to join with you in this uh, August uh, or, um, uh, program. Uh, that is the IPDC, uh, uh, probably opening ceremony. And this is the, uh, I, 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 I like to say that it is a great pleasure for me also because you people are trying to do something for the humanity, for the people of the uh, at large of the country, and you are uh, you are trying to uh, uh, what I like to say you are trying to develop the skill among the doctors and the medical uh, uh, technologists and others, the nurses and others. Uh, as I have heard from uh, Mr. Uh, the VC of the Bangabandhu Medical College that uh, you are trying to develop. Uh, as a skill building project and I hope that your project will be a successful one and the people at large of the Bangladesh and the all the people uh, uh, will be benefited from this program and from this uh, 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 what I like to say the, this institute probably it is an institute you are going to build up an institute so I hope uh, it will uh, it will be beneficial for the uh, for the people of the Bangladesh and I I I like to i i like to say that this is uh, uh, this will be one of the one of the finest uh, center of, of uh, and it is a uh, center for excellence in future uh, with this uh, award i would like to say uh, uh, thanks and goodbye Thank you, sir. Thank you for your valuable comments. Uh, there is some change in our schedule because uh, our, uh, our chief guest have another program. So he requested to uh, speak few words earlier. So now I'd like to request National Professor Bigger Abdul Malik, sir, our chief guest to say a few words. Bigger Malik, sir. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. Professor Chairman of today's session. First of all, <clears throat> I would like to congratulate him and his colleague for arranging this inaugural ceremony for Center of Research and Training by IPDI Foundation. Now, disease pattern is changing. Last century, during 1917 and 60s, the pattern of disease were different. At that time, the Communicable disease was a big problem, and today is non communicable disease. Now, research is very important, training is important, because unless we know the cause and how and why the disease occurs and what is the prevalence of disease. If you do not know, we cannot tackle it. So research brings us truth, 
Actually, what we have to do? Bring light to us from darkness. So there is no alternative to research. Today, in any field, whatever progress has been made by human being is due to research. So we will have to continue the research to find out the truth, how to prevent, how to control the disease, what to be done, what is to be done. I just tell you, in 1970 and 71, when I came to join Postulate Medicine, now Bangabandhu Sheikh, Mujik Medical University, at that time, there are no actual figures about the prevalence and pattern of disease in Bangladesh, about cardiovascular disease, I mean. So people used to tell us that time that we are confronted with communicable disease, infectious disease, malnutrition. So non-communicable disease is not a problem. At that time, I thought there should be some survey. And in 1973, with the help of the Medical Research Council, I conducted a survey in dark and around, and it was revealing to me that all types of congenital acquired heart disease are there. The pattern of disease was hypertension was number one, because clinically, we do not find hypertensive case. When they come, they come with stroke, heart failure, or some problem. And many of them remain silent. They do not come to the doctors. So number one was hypertension. And today, even today, the hypertension prevalence 20 to 20 percent in adult population because this is a silent killer. It does not come. It does not reveal. And people come when there is a problem. Second was at that time was rheumatic fever and rheumatic heart disease, which was found among poor people living in overcrowding and poverty. And third was ischemic heart disease. Then congenital heart disease was there. At that time, there was another factor. People used to say, the heart disease, the disease of rich people, it is not a disease of common people. What happened? During that research, I could find that poor people living in overcrowding and poverty has got rheumatic heart disease. Hypertension is common among poor and rich. Only ischemic heart disease is commonly present in the rich people. In 1974, in New Delhi, there was a WHO conference at that time. There was discussion going on there, and what revealed was that the whole Southeast Asia region, pattern of disease, India, Pakistan, and not Pakistan was not there in Southeast Asia region. India, Burma, Nepal, Sri Lanka, and all the countries, Malaysia, all the countries have got more or the same disease pattern. Number one was hypertension, second was rheumatic. And third was the skin heart disease. Today, rheumatic heart disease has been controlled in our country. Now we have got ischemic heart disease is a big problem for us. Hypertension even remains there. So what I meant to say that there is no alternative but to research. You will have to find out the truth and then go ahead with it. So I thank Professor Odul and others for doing this and taking this program for research, which will be very useful for our future generation. So I congratulate them and I wish them success. Second, it's training. There is no alternative to training. Training is very important, particularly cardiology. Theoretical knowledge is important, but practical knowledge is more important than theoretical knowledge. So you are taking the step for training of people, and I congratulate them, you, that you are taking not only training for doctors, nurses, and all technicians, because whole team must be trained. Doctors alone cannot do. There is no problem about 
There are machines. You can get machines, but you cannot get trained manpower. And manpower does not develop one day. So thank you very much for taking this program. And I wish you very success. And I must also say, we must have sufficient number of trained people so that we can spread our activities in all the divisional headquarters particularly and gradually down the level. Dhaka alone cannot serve the whole country. So we'll have to take keep program, not only government level, private level, every level. And then other things, preventive program. You have also told, you have got also desire to go to the community level. This is very important. We should have create awareness among people. Prevention is very important for us. Please remember, the hospital will not solve the problem, particularly non-communicable non -communicable disease. Today, all the world is facing the problem, corona. Corona has come, vaccine has come up, and inshallah, it will be controlled soon. But this non-communicable disease, heart, cancer, diabetes, these are all lifestyle diseases. We have brought it, mostly. So we will have to control it and it will have to take in measures. And change of lifestyle, avoid unhealthy diet, physical activity, avoid smoking. And this cannot be done one in a day or two. Government alone cannot do. All people, and I always say that prevention, create awareness, that should be mass movement. The social movement, all of us should be careful because unless we control this non communicable disease, we cannot remain healthy. An unhealthy nation cannot live with dignity in this present world, global. world has become global village. If you want to remain prosperous, if you want to go ahead, ahead then you will have to keep your people healthy mentally and physically. So I prolong my speech. Thank you very much for initiative. I wish you success and I hope, inshallah, you will proceed and be successful. But please remember, the starting is not the only thing. You will have to continue. There's a long way to go and you will have to work properly. Unless you remain with this persistently, success will not come. God help those who help themselves and if you work, you will get the reward. Thank you very much. I wish you great success. And I again congratulate you. During this COVID period last year, you have made a lot of progress, a lot of program online. And I'm sure those people have been affected. Useful. This will be very useful. Thank you very much. We are together. And I congratulate the younger generation that taking us. Bangladesh is going ahead. It will go, and Bangladesh we want a healthy Bangladesh, educated, with and please remember, we must ethically we should do the best. Thank you very much. Thank you very much for inviting me and allow me to say a few words. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your gracious presence, which marked this spectacular evening more remarkable. Uh, this our press giving celebration will be start soon. Uh, but first, I would like to request Professor Abdul Wadud Choudhury sir to hand over crest of our chief guest and to uh, Professor Mohsen sir to receive this guest on behalf of our chief guest. And this crest will be handed over to sir at his residence. Thank, Thank you, you very much. Thank you very much. Now I would like to request to hand over guest uh, to Mr. A.M. Aminuddin, sir. And this will be handed over by our president and it will be received by uh, Advocate Ekum Kayam Braja Chaudhuri, President, Healthy Heart, Healthy Life Organization. Now I'd like to request to hand it over to Chris to our 
Honorable Professor Dr. Konakanti Borua, sir. Honorable Vice Chancellor, Bangabundu Sheikh Mujib Medical University. Now I'd like to request the hand it over the crest to our Honorable President, Bangladesh Cardiac Society, Professor A.K. Mohibullah, sir. And this will be also handed over to his SARS resident. <clears throat> Thank you, sir. Now I'd like to request uh, thank you very much. Thank you very much, Dr. Rajiv Chaudhary and Dr. Mohsen. sir, former director and professor, National Institute of Cardiovascular Diseases, and Secretary General, Bangladesh Cardiac Society, to say a few words. Professor Abdullah Shafi Muzumdar, sir. Yes, very good evening. Very good evening. The my dear chairman of this session, Professor Abdul Rajiv Chaudhary, and the other guest. Uh, in the, I take this opportunity to express my deepest regards to, my, to our teacher, National Professor Brigadier Abdul Malik, the chief guest of this session, and the, my regards to all the other guests. And it is indeed a great pleasure to be present in this inaugural function of the office of the IPDI. Actually, the IPDI has started its work for the last uh, many months. And the, this is one of the fruits of the corona pandemic that the IPDI can work uh, in full swing for the many weeks. Uh, and the, this occasion, this is the occasion of the opening of the office. And it will be a very good initiative to have an office by the uh, center, by the organization, uh, because it will help to have the new address and the, to have the training program to be organized in this, uh, in this office room. So my congratulations to all the organizers and I am I feel honored to be associated with IPDI as the advisor and I hope that in the future the IPDI will flourish further on and um, uh, it will achieve its goals as described by the president and the secretary general of the IPDI. With these few words, with the, all the best wishes for the IPDI and uh, with the God bless us all. Thank you very much. Thank you for your valuable comments. And uh, I would like to request uh, Dr. N. A. Momurud Jaman, sir, Chief Consul in Union Hospital, Dhaka, former President, Bangladesh Society of Cardiovascular Intervention, to say a few words. Uh, honorable Chairman of IPDI, uh, General Secretary, and uh, uh, our uh, chief guest, Brigadier Malik, sir, and all other dignitaries, uh, uh, both connected with Zoom and, uh, and virtual and actual. Uh, indeed, it's a great pleasure for me to be a part of this inaugural session um, uh, organized by IPDI. Uh, really, uh, it's a good step in a sense. Uh, 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 personally, I didn't thought about that it, this sort of program can be a, uh, organized to develop the skillness, awareness, and maybe educational uh, uh, program through a, a organizing committee like IPDI. So far for last one year, they have done a tremendous job uh, organizing many virtual uh, um, session and training program for the doctors, nurses, technicians. And definitely uh, the main uh, um, focus is for the junior uh, to develop their skillness uh, what uh, personally I have not able to done, uh, I have seen the, the, my dream through this IPDI and the development of uh, 
skilled personnel uh, to to continue the development of uh, uh, cardiology, especially because here most of the person involved here is the cardiologist uh, uh, to develop to a level so that we can proudly say we are not lacking behind of international standard. One uh, special attention uh, already they have given, and I also feel that we need to give more emphasis on research. Uh, to me, uh, for last 20 years, every technical part that I have done, I have got a hard copy. Everything for last 20, it is, I make a book and it's almost, it is 140 book, each 100 pages, but nothing came out from that, this, that uh, hard copy uh, by myself because of my busyness. And most important, I have got not capac that capacity to do research. And I think the young generation, uh, some of them should have that capacity because everybody cannot be a poet. Everybody cannot write a poem. Some of them will definitely take over this part. Maybe they can also uh, take uh, the data from us uh, to, to, to make some, uh, some written form of research. That things I think very essential uh, uh, also to, to, to involve the different uh, seniors, uh, particularly in the research world. Uh, I especially um, uh, 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 said both uh, Dr. Wadud and Mohsin to take a special initiative to make a research cell uh, with few advisors and do some uh, um, protocol, 10, 15 protocol and, and, and find out some of the interested person who will uh, be doing these things in collaboration with us. And uh, definitely it will uh, go to the level what they are dreaming. And also I will uh, be satisfied uh, to see this goal, what I have not achieved myself. And uh, I pray to God for uh, continuous uh, improvement of this program, this uh, um, center to a level that it can be a, a center of excellence for training, uh, especially the nurse and doctors. I think they might have some other program, but as a physician, as my more intention is to make uh, a program for uh, training to the junior doctors. Uh, with these few words, once again, I thank uh, Dr. Uh, Professor Wadud, Mohsin, and all other dignitaries to give me opportunity to, to uh, take part of this program. And thank you very much once again. Asalaamu Alaikum. Thank you, sir. Thanks a lot. It would be our duty to follow your footsteps. Uh, at the present moment, I would like to request Professor Dr. Abdul Rahman, sir, Chairman, Bangla International Therapeutics, former director and professor, National Institute of Cardiovascular Diseases, and former president, Bangladesh Society of Cardiovascular Intervention. Professor Abdul Rahman is such a personality which has escalated the standard of interventional cardiology of the level to a standard sky high level. So, and he also trained hundreds of interventional cardiologists, and his followers are working toward the globe with great reputation. Sir, plus please see a few words regarding and followers. Professor Abdul Rahman, sir. Asalaamu Alaikum and good evening. Thank you very much for inviting me. It is really honored for me that you have been um, attached me to the IPDI. And uh, honorable chief guest and special guest and dignitaries and my friend Imad Subhan, uh, who will be the who will who will I will see you very soon in the uh, BIT program P six seven because I have taken his consent from him and all the dignitaries. So uh, good evening and assalamualaikum. So 
my regards to the chairman and secretary general of the IPDI. They have they have um, made up a fantastic platform that for training of the junior doctors and the nurses and technicians, and also they will focus the research. This is very important for us also. So um, uh, with this free word, it is again, thank you to all. And I hope that you will move forward and uh, you will contribute uh, to the nation, especially the young doctors and future generation. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you for thank you. your advice and question will be our uh, path so that we can reach a certain level like you. Uh, in the meantime, uh, we have talked with our international advisory board, Professor Iman Shivan. We have also with Professor Tan Hui Chem, Professor Dr. Shundip Mishra, Dr. John C. George, and Professor Dr. Shohid Marchin with us. Now I'd like to request Dr. Shohid Marchin, sir, to say a few words. So please unmute, sir. Thank you, my brothers. It is such a pleasure today to be with all of you from Bangladesh. And I never expected this kind of uh, reception. And I'm so happy. And this is uh, very awesome, you know, that uh, an institute like this is being set up for training, for knowledge sharing, and for the growth of Bangladesh. My good wishes to all the dignitaries on the dais, to the chairperson, to the chief guest, to my colleague, uh, Professor Iman Shiban and to Professor Wadud and to uh, Dr. Mohsen, who has been continuously in touch uh, uh, with me to uh, see how uh, we could make uh, IBDI uh, at a, a global level uh, to share knowledge, to invite guests, and to uh, make uh, Bangladesh on the chart of interventional cardiology. All my good luck, all my best wishes for the organization, and uh, any help required, uh, please be free. Uh, to just contact and I will be there to support uh, the organization. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your valuable comments. Uh, Professor Dr. Radon, sir. Sir, are you with us now? Professor Dr. Radon, sir. Uh, th thank you very much. Thank you for inviting me to be here. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay, I am <clears throat> uh, delighted to see an organization like IPDI is developing in Bangladesh. Uh, and uh, we uh, uh, really, uh, this is a gap area in the country gap area in the sense that uh, as Dr. Mohan Joman has very rightly pointed out that he has uh, done a lot of uh, hard works in paperworks, but it still didn't come up with uh, many publications. So uh, I believe that the interventional cardiologist in Bangladesh, the amount of job per person uh, is one of the highest uh, in the world. Many of our colleagues have such skill and uh, had to contribute because of lack of uh, available persons. The initiative that has been taken by uh, Wadud and uh, Maushin, or both of them are my junior brothers. Uh, I am very optimistic and I am very helpful that someone should come up uh, not for ourselves, because uh, many of us are getting old and uh, uh, may not be able to perform for very long. Uh, so we need to uh, develop a, 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 an atmosphere, a support for the junior level physicians, in addition to the existing people uh, who, who are contributing in this field. So Bangladesh has uh, uh, enormous opportunity, I must say, in terms of working in limited facility situations. Uh, however, because of their multi multifarious engagements, like teaching, training, consultancy, uh, private practice, research, everything are really difficult to combine together. So I think organizations like IPDI uh, should uh, should 
provide a forum to provide an institute for training and to uh, provide a support in terms of doing research in Bangladesh. So I, I have I am very happy that I have been inducted uh, and have been invited to be here. Uh, I am very optimistic of the expressions made by previous speakers. And uh, uh, I wish that this organization will go uh, uh, much forward, uh, long forward uh, to uh, institutionalize uh, research work in Bangladesh in the field of cardiology to begin with, maybe in other uh, fields also. So thank you very much. Thank you for inviting me to be here. Sir, sir uh, you are not a guest, sir. You are part of IBDA, sir. Sir, oh, okay, uh, thank you. For, not for only cardiologist. Uh, this is Center for Professional Development. You see, there is no medical term here. It is the IPDI. It is the only professional development. We start from cardiology because we work in the cardiology. But I think you, uh, the, one of the fellow support, I have your mentors, uh, your, your suggestions, everything Dr. Mohan Jawan said, everything. Professor Sundip Mustra also here. I think you and Professor Sundip Mustra will be very module for the juniors. We will coming forward with, as Bodhman said, some making the protocols. And we think we fortunate uh, doing the, some research work. Thank you, sir. Being with us, sir. sir. Thank you, sir. Uh, IPDI is here to break the boundaries. Uh, we, we, we like to work beyond our subjects and capacities with the active participation, and active advice of yours. Now, I'd like to request Professor Dr. Shundip Mishra, Professor of Cardiology, All India Institute of Medical Science, New Delhi. Sir, say a few words. Professor Mishra. Please unmute yourself. Okay. Uh, thank you very much, uh, everybody. First of all, congratulations for this very great initiative. Uh, and I, I know uh, Dr. Mohsen and uh, all, all of you uh, who have been instrumental in uh, bringing about this uh, great endeavor, I think, which is which will be useful not only in the field of cardiology, but I'm sure it will, uh, you know, expand and involve other areas of medicine. And not only in Bangladesh, I already know that it has uh, been followed in uh, India and uh, Nepal and uh, some other countries, but I'm sure uh, you, it can expand uh, globally, especially in South Asia and uh, then, uh, then Asia and, you know, and beyond. So <clears throat> I think the, uh, the, thing that will really matter is number one uh, the commitment of the faculty and of course the course directors uh, who are uh, bringing about uh, this uh, whole uh, event and uh, not only commitment but also you know world class quality of the product uh, and which means the teaching material uh, the content of the teaching material and the experience of the teachers and the faculty that we are that uh, we are able to bring about uh, would certainly make it attractive uh, to uh, at least this part of the world. That part, I'm pretty sure that uh, this will be very useful for this part of the world. But uh, I'm, I'm sure uh, slowly, you know, others will also join in and, uh, uh, you know, become a part of it. So I'm really very uh, actually enthused and excited and uh, very hopeful that uh, it will uh, be a very big, uh, uh, it will start a very big uh, chapter in the field of uh, medical education, uh, at least in this part of the world. So thank you very much for uh, inviting me to be a part of it. And uh, I know, actually, I think now I know most of you, uh, even personally, and um, I think, uh, you know, particularly Bangladesh is, uh, the hospitality of Bangladesh is, I think, warmest uh, in the globe. Uh, and so, uh, and uh, we, we really feel that uh, we are uh, part of you only. And uh, uh, it's certainly very, uh, uh, you know, helps us to contribute and uh, be part of the whole movement. Thank you very much, everybody. Sir, thanks a lot. Your presence is always inspiring for us. Person like you, embrace the standard of IPDA. Thank you, sir. Thank now you. I'd like to request Professor Emeritus, Dr. Sufia Rahman, Madam, 
former director and professor national institute of cardiovascular diseases to say few words sufia ma'am assalamu alaikum good evening to everybody i'm sorry uh, actually i'm out of dhaka and i left my laptop in a hurry i couldn't get connected uh, to you in time just only five minutes maybe i'm connected so i missed uh, all uh, the important talks given by different people uh, i'm sorry about that but i'm glad at the end it's never late i got connected um Uh, what to say? I mean, uh, uh, Professor Odu and Dr. Moshin has done something which is unique for Bangladesh, and it has spread globally, and it's an international event now. It's a very nice work. I'm, I'm proud, power proud of both of them. If we think about this pandemic situation, when they started it, they started uh, for the fellows, doctors, nurses. and then technicians and um, all over those uh, like us um, i have involved myself with them to be a part of it because i feel proud that they were my student one day what they have done and i'm sure it will go beyond what they are doing now it has already made a place in everybody's life and uh, education is an it never ends you are, if you stop learning you have stopped educated yourself and you you have finished so what they are doing continuously i have missed one or two episodes of there but i have always tried to attend that and i liked it as well and the way they are going i'm sure they have experienced uh, themselves for last one year enough to do much better events and much better work in future is the everybody no uh, cannot do everything like organizing capacity somebody has to have somebody has a more technical knowledge and technical work somebody has more literal uh, literatural activity so these are i i'm 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 sure with combining all this quality and having everybody in their boat what they are trying to do in that same platform is a unique event and as you know as you know that it has is not in uh, limited to cardiology department only it has spread from cardiology to all other department it has also spread to outside like um, our students are in there in uh, nepal india and also our colleagues globally those are interested in uh, cardiology and uh, interventional cardiology all of them you probably know uh, all of you that when i started interventional cardiology bangladesh in first time that was the time uh, was not a very easy one to be a lady is not easy till today uh, but at the end uh, we could do it in bangladesh and i i, I remember all my uh, rough path what i came through but i have never ever stopped it teaching anybody what whoever has come to cardiology had interest to do the intervention i have spread my both hand and my heart to make them educated not in giving the training in nicvd you know that it is a mother institute there they are all trained and a huge number of patients are there to get the experience and i have made them to see the other side of the world uh, like going abroad different countries like japan europe uk japan, singapore malaysia all these countries so that they can see what is going on uh, out of bangladesh and they have seen it i'm glad they have seen it they've learned it that applied in bangladesh what i started in early days when uh, no intervention I uh, was there but so glad that they were so encouraged they were so interested they also encouraged me also to do my work and they were behind me all the time and that is something uh, which i got is very few people gets it i was lucky in that sense and they were always with me supporting me for my work and they were so eager to learn they were interested and i was also so eager to teach them 
and i was i had a feeling that then i must teach them quickly quickly as soon as i can my rushing them like anything and they some of them are doing very well I, today you see there is all institutes all medical college mainly cardiology department in intervention all my students are head of the department part I, uh, today I, i'm sure um, now i've missed the early part so i don't know professor momir jaman is uh, one of them abzal rahman is one of them odudi there fozila is there uh, i can name any all of them i can name so many and, and you, all the institutes they are head of the cardio interventional cardiology and they are doing so nice work so good work and they are all international standard so that is something which is uh, worth doing what i did um when we started doing we started plain balloon then we started plain uh, bsm uh, bms uh, stand crimping and now you get it on the balloon and now you get all drug eluting ones as well so you all know what they what we have come through what we have passed and what you are enjoying now and moreover i am enjoying more than what you are enjoying to see you work nicely successfully internationally and globally you have made bangladesh once i started but you are you are spreading it so nicely really i congratulate all of you i congratulate professor wadud and moshin to take initiative yes, because you had the capacity to do it i didn't have that and so they what you have is a, um, inshallah you'll do more and more and more, most important thing is you make manpower so that they will continue your good work it must continue it, if, if you don't continue then it's a, a fini, it will finish so i hope you will leave your uh, train your manpower and they will for, uh, keep doing your work maybe better than you uh, and um, i wish all the success from my heart and that you will do much better on the days come and i was i was always be there whether you want it or not but i was always with you and i really enjoyed to be with you and to, to see all of your work really makes me happy so i wish you good health in this pandemic situation and good work and keep doing doing good work and never look back go forward and my blessings are always will be there and allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will help you as well good, uh, good night and allah hafiz thank you Thank you, madam. You are teacher of our teachers. Your every story is inspiring for all of us. Now I'd like to request Mr. M.D. Moshir Rahman, former additional secretary, Ministry of Health and Family Welfare, People's Republic of Bangladesh. Mr. Moshir Rahman, sir. Sir, unmute yourself, sir. Assalamu alaikum. Assalamu alaikum. Hello. Yes, I can hear you, sir. Asker, a onushane jogdan korte pere. Ami nijke shonmani the bhot korchi. বাংলাদেশের স্বাস্থ্য ব্যবস্থাপনায় আজকের এই প্রতিষ্ঠান আমি মনে করি গুরুত্বপূর্ণ অবদান রাখবে স্বাস্থ্য ব্যবস্থাপনায় কাজ করতে গিয়ে আমরা দেখেছি যে আমাদের দক্ষ জনশক্তির অভাব এবং এটা খুব প্রকট আগামী দিনে আমি মনে করি আমাদের এই প্রতিষ্ঠান স্বাস্থ্য ব্যবস্থাপনায় বাতি ঘর হিসাবে কাজ করবে যারা এই উদ্যোগ নিয়েছেন বিশেষ করে প্রফেসর অদুদ সাহেব এবং মহসিন তারা যে উদ্যোগ নিয়েছে তাদের এই উদ্যোগ অত্যন্ত প্রশংসাজনক এবং আগামী দিনে এখান থেকে দক্ষ জনশক্তি তৈরি হবে এবং তারা নিজকে আলোকিত করবে বাংলাদেশকে আলোকিত করবে এবং সাধারণ মানুষের স্বাস্থ্য ব্যবস্থাপনা আরও উন্নত হবে আমি এই প্রতিষ্ঠানের উত্তর উত্তর উন্নতি কামনা করি 
এবং পবিস্তা অদুস সাহেব এবং মহসিনের সুস্বাস্থ্য কামনা করি এই প্রতিষ্ঠানে এগিয়ে যাক ধন্যবাদ সকল Thank you, sir, for your valuable words. Now I'd like to request Professor Dr. Mir Jamaluddin, sir, Honorable Director and Professor National Institute of Cardiovascular Diseases, Honorable Secretary General of Bangladesh Society of Cardiovascular Intervention. Professor Mir Jamaluddin, sir. Can you hear me? <laughs> Arif, can you hear me? Yes, sir. <clears throat> okay. Respected president of this session in Interactive Professional Development Initiative Foundation Research and Training Center inaugural ceremony, Professor Abdul Wadud Choudhury, Chairman and Course Director of IPDI and Dr. Mohsin Ahmed, Secretary General and Course Director, IPDI. The chief guest of the session, Professor Vigadier, retired Malik sir, and the special guests, M. Aminuddin, Honorable Attorney General Bangladesh, Professor Dr. Konokkanti Borua, Honorable Vice Chancellor, Bangabandhu Sheikh Mujib Medical University, Professor A.K.M. Mohibullah, President Bangladesh Cardiac Society and IPDI National Advisory Board Member, <laughs> Professor Dr. Um, Abdullah Al Shafi Mazumdar, Secretary General Bangladesh Society, uh, Cardiac Society and ex Director National Institute of Cardiovascular Diseases, Professor N.M. Mominud Jaman, ex President BSCI, and Professor Abjalur Rahman, uh, Chairman BIT, as well as ex President. BSCI and ex director of National Institute of Cardiovascular Diseases, Professor Ridwan Rahman, and guest of honor, um, uh, Emeritus Professor Subia Rahman, founder interventional cardiologist and founder president of Bangladesh Society of Cardiovascular Intervention, Mohammad Mashur Rahman Shaib, Professor Swed Ali Hassan, chairman department of cardiology, Bangabandhu Sheikh Mujib Medical University, Dr. Shams Monwar. From Evercare Hospital, Professor Fazilatunna Samalik, Head of the Department and Chairman Department of Cardiology and Chief Interventional Cardiologist National Heart Foundation and Research Institute, Professor Mahmoud Shahbuddin, Head of the Department of Cardiology, uh, uh, Select Medical College, and Professor uh, Praveer Kumar Dash, Head of the Department of Cardiology, Chitawang Medical College, Professor uh, Arun, Dr. Arun Maski from Nepal, Professor Dr. Nazrul Islam, and Elias Khan, journalist, advocate, Kamrul uh, Kayum Khan, Professor Mir Jamaluddin, not me, another professor from another subject, and the international faculty, they are also advisor, they are also present in this program, Professor Emad Shivan, Director of International Cardiology, and uh, Pedro Julo Hospital, Verona, Italy, Professor Dr. Tan Huisim, Director of National University Hospital, Singapore, and President Singapore Heart Foundation, Professor, uh, uh, professor uh, from uh, Cardiology of All India Institute of Medical Science, and John George, and Dr. S. Uh, Marsan from Bombay, and other persons of uh, this um, uh, IPDI, particularly our um, cardiology section, sector, uh, Professor uh, Choudhury Meshkat Ahmed, Professor Dr. Khaled Mohsin, Dr. Ken, uh, Kaisan Nasrullah Khan, ex-Secretary General of uh, Bangladesh Society of Cardiovascular Intervention, Dr. Uh, Arif and Dr. Monwar, Associate Professor, National Institute of Cardiovascular Diseases. Assalamu alaikum to all and good evening. It's my pleasure that I am here in this August gathering for the opening ceremony of IPDI Foundation for their research activities, research and training activities. Through the last entire year in the COVID era, what they have shown in the field of uh, study 
uh, not only in the field of intervention, entire field of cardiology, non-invasive, invasive, uh, as well as uh, other uh, general topics uh, like uh, COVID, they have given us uh, many interesting topics and we have learned many things from the different topics by the different uh, speakers from home and abroad and we are grateful to them. I must congratulate this idea from IPDI by Professor M. Wadud and Dr. Mohsin for doing this nice work in the field of cardiology. With the development of this training and um, uh, center of IPDI, I think they have uh, developed a, a milestone in this field and they have uh, improved this field uh, uh, hopefully in the uh, next. And I have, I have every respect and honor to all the learned national and international faculty involved in IPDI uh, with the hope and belief that IPDI will be able to meet the academic demands of the young cardiologists with their effective role in this field. And we know that research is the mother of any interest, any uh, subject, but that is lack in our country. So I hope that by their endeavor, we shall be able to overcome that and we uh, should be uh, uh, stand up in the level of international uh, status in the field of interventional cardiology, cardiology, as well as in research part. I once again congratulate the authority for arranging this type of promising academic training research center. Thank you all. Thank you very much. Assalamu alaikum. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your valuable words. Your contribution for the expanding of radial intervention in our country is remarkable. We will be also remembered for the Bangladesh radial intervention course, which have a great impact in the expanding the subject. Now I'd like to request Professor Fuzila Tunnasa Malik, Madam, Chief Consultant, Department of Cardiology, National Heart Foundation, Hospital and Research Institute to say few words. Professor Fuzila Tunnasa Malik, Madam. Can you hear me? Yes, sir. Yes, madam. Okay. So, uh, respect my respected teachers, uh, colleagues, friends, and students. Uh, this is indeed a great occasion for all of us. And this is indeed a historical occasion. And I'm very grateful to God that I have been made a part of this huge gathering to this and thank you to the organizers for giving me this opportunity to be here and as the saying goes a thousand mile journey starts with a first step and today is the formal inauguration of this great organization however we have seen the magnitude and the scope that this uh, organization has and the dynamic leadership of professor Wadud and Pro dr mohsin and the others who are associated with it. I'm really so grateful that you have taken this initiative to do this wonderful work, which gives our young cardiologists an opportunity uh, to work on their skills. And not only cardiologists, as you have said, uh, the scope is immense. And a few days, uh, I mean, uh, I think it was quite a few days back, I was talking to Wadud and I was saying that, you know, this COVID has been in a way a silver lining for lots of uh, things. And one of them is that we found the scope and the diversity of uh, webinars. And in fact, we found with webinars that we could connect to each other and we were truly a global village and we are really connected. And through this connection, strangers have become friends and it feels like we all know each other. And it's been such a wonderful experience. And I hope that you will continue doing the great work that you're doing and we will always be by your side and best of luck with all your future endeavors. And thank you for again, inviting me here. Thanks a lot. Thanks a lot for your valuable comments. It's my uh, opportunity 
and to be here and I am delighted to inform that I started my cardiology career under your direct supervision in National Heart Foundation. And I'd like to request Professor Dr. Mohammed Shahabuddin, sir, Professor and Head of the Department of Cardiology. Thank you. Let M.A.G. Usmani Medical College. Professor Shahabuddin, sir. Assalamu alaikum. Good evening from Select. First of all, I congratulate uh, giving a special thanks to the organizer who has given the thoughts that this type of organization or institution can be run in this Bangladesh. It is a very imaging thought that they have thought like this type of institution to be run by the Bangladeshi young for young cardiologists, but not for young cardiologists, it is also for all the cardiologists and other internists and other professions that who can learn from this institution. Mr. Chairman, my teachers, colleagues and friends, very good evening again from Select. I congratulate all of you and I uh, hope that this organization will go far, far and far with very, very success. Thanks everyone. Thanks the organizer for inviting me to say something. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Thanks a lot. Uh, your presence in the IPDI manuals inspired a lot. And you are also doing great job in SILET in the Society of Interventional Cardiology. Thank you, sir. Now I'd like to request Professor Dr. Prabir Kumar Dash, Professor and Head of the Department of Cardiology, Chittagong Medical College. Professor Dr. Prabir Kumar Dash. Thank you, Dr. Shajal. Can you hear me? Am I audible? Yes. Thanks to the organizer of IPDI. The initiative already taken by Professor Wadud, Dr. Mohsin, and their program is uh, continuing for the last few years. So all of us know Bangladesh is developing. It is developing in economic field. We are constructing the Padma River. But there are some places where we are actually least developed. And IPDI has find out, find out this uh, area where uh, our development is uh, least and we are lagging behind. So this is an area that is the area of professionals to be developed and they are uh, 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 providing their uh, initiative, they are uh, exerting their uh, uh, capacity in development of professionals. Actually, the professional development, uh, not only the professional field is developing, also I think the teaching skill of uh, the persons who are involved in this program is developing. We are to look after uh, the knowledge, the skill, as well as uh, the attitude. So these three should uh, run side by side. Uh, the, uh, along with this professional development, our teaching skills should be developed. And, and the IPDI initiative, that is uh, the Interactive Professional Development Initiative, is looking after all these three areas. And in uh, near future, they will be providing uh, training in their office. So this is the uh, inaugural ceremony of their uh, uh, physical uh, existence in an uh, office. And I am eagerly waiting for uh, interaction, not only in virtual interaction. I am waiting for uh, physical interaction when the COVID will be completely controlled and will be coming to meet physically together. And we will we'll have interaction with our friends, with all of uh, those who are uh, actively involved in IPDA program. With this few what and uh, well wishes, in this uh, new year 2021, uh, I uh, conclude. Thank you all. Thank you, sir. Thanks a lot for your comments. Uh, we all know you are also a writer, and we have lots of books in your collection. 
we hope uh, you will send a full set of our written books to enrich our IPDA library. Thank you, sir. I'd like to- Surely, surely, surely. Okay. I'll be glad to, to, to send to, to provide all these books. He is a senior consultant, Department of Cardiology, Shohit Gongalang National Heart Center, Katmandu, Nepal. Professor Dr. Arun Maski. Oh. Uh, Chief Guest, National Professor Brigadier Malik, sir. My teacher, guide, and mentor, Professor Sufia Rahman. My teacher, Afzali Rahman. Professor uh, Meskat Ahmad. Professor Mir Jamaluddin. Uh, Professor Safi Majumda. My uh, Professor Momini Jaman. And my all teachers. With my due respect to all my teachers, because I have passed from Bangladesh and have a special bone with all my teachers and colleagues. And from starting as a webinar in IPDI, now it has transformed into research and training institute. This is a very great initiative. I congratulate Professor Wadud and Mohsen for taking these initiatives. And I congratulate all of the team for making this event a success. And with the international advisors like Professor Tan Wichin, Professor Sevan, Professor Sandeep Mishra, Professor John C. George, Professor Dr. Said Merchant, and whole team. I think this will transfer into a good academic and research institution. My best wishes and congratul congratulations to all IPDI team. Thank you. And thank you from Nepal. And IPDI is very thank helpful you, for our Thanks students. Uh, we wish our friendship with Nepal will be continued with your hands. Uh, we have our Professor Dr. Nazmul Islam, sir, Line Director, Communicable Disease Control, Director General of Health Services with us. I'd like to request Professor Dr. Nazmul Islam, sir, to say a few words. Professor Dr. Nazmul Islam, sir. Assalamu alaikum. Very good evening. Honorable Chairperson of the session, Inauguration Ceremony of IPDI, Research and Training Center, and uh, my dear colleagues from Bangladesh and dignitaries from home and abroad, uh, I'm really uh, feel, uh, feeling honored uh, for inviting me in this August uh, inaugural session. Uh, as we, you, we know we are uh, going to celebrate the uh, centenary uh, birthday of Father of Nation, Bhagavad Sheikh Mujibur Rahman, and we all know that we have uh, celebrated uh, 50 years of independence. And since our inception of this country, we have really uh, progressed far in all fields, in economic field, in social, in medical sciences. But, but we know there is, uh, there's lots of scopes for improvement, particularly in the field of research. And I would like to congratulate Professor Wadud, Professor Mohsin, and their team. They have rightly uh, taken the initiative uh, to focus on the uh, research activities. Uh, if, we, if we want to stand in the, in the field of medical science, if we want to achieve the world standard, we, if, we, if we want to uh, keep our head high, we need to invest spend more in the research activities in terms of uh, time, money, and definitely uh, in our devotion to research. So again, I would like to uh, congratulate uh, Professor Badud, uh, Professor Ma Dr. Mohsin and their team to take this great initiative uh, for the Bangladeshi students as well as for the uh, uh, students outside the country. I hope they will uh, take uh, all necessary steps to make this initiative in a, in a, to convert into an organization. Uh, we know that government cannot do all the research activities. Government cannot fund in all research activities, but government can extend their support, which is very essential to conduct research to, for transferring the technology, knowledge, and skill. With these uh, few words, I again, I would like to uh, uh, convey my heartfelt thanks and gratitude to the organizers. They have taken the right initiative and I believe we will be with them. May Almighty bless them. May Almighty bless the initiative. Thank you very much for inviting me. Thank you once again. Assalamu alaikum. Thank you, thank you, Nazmul. It's the Munna Bhai. Munna Bhai, Amade Munna Bhai. Uh, he's the most popular student in Chidamari College. Uh, you are not a guest. You are the part of the IBJ because you are the CDC control. I think Dr. Robita Bhai, bhai is the our I, I most fair fan of Munna Bhai and Robita Bhai. I think. Uh, we'll uh, take initiatives to help our IPDI can work with CDC and NDC. I think, uh, thank you so much for joining with us. Thank you. Mohsin, thank you very much for inviting me. Uh, I am so certain that if Robert and uh, me, if we can work together, 
uh, certainly we can initiate some sort of change, which is very essential uh, for this decade. And I believe whatever we do, whenever we do, wherever we go, we will be with you. And certainly we will be with you. Thank you very much. Thank you for inviting me. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Thank you for your comments. And you're, uh, we will be delighted to have your contribution in IPDA. And I would like to have uh, Professor Dr. Roman Amin, sir, Line Director, Non-Communicable Disease Control, Director General of Health Services. Uh, he's such a character who will be there. It's like a dream character for the youngsters. Sir, please say a few words for youngsters, sir. Uh, thank you very much, Dr. Arif. Uh, first of all, uh, thank you very much, IPDA, for inviting me in this uh, auspicious occasion of inaugural. This is a wonderful office. I just you were bringing me on to say that when I get an entry into the office, beautiful office. So thank you very much, uh, our honorable chairperson, Professor Vodit Sir, whom I have been working uh, for long in Dhaka Medical College, neck to neck. It was a wonderful experience for me to have such a brilliant uh, scholar like you uh, working together. Uh, the dynamism of the Dr. Professor Mohsin has been the highlighting features of the IPDA, I would say. I am at the part of the IPDF from the very beginning. I would say that during this time of pandemic, you'll find that the scientific revolution has become a so much expedited that we had the initial case reported in the December 2019, and within a year, we get a vaccine. And it pushes. Can you imagine? And look at another development of the science. IPDA started their features within a year of time by doing some sort of the webinar, as well as scientific evaluations in country, and then make it globally surrounded all through the year within a mass period of time. And now, within a year time, you had an office. And we are inaugurating a superb research center and the training center of our country, which we have been lacking for long. So thank you very much. This was a fantastic phenomena. And look at the numbers and the look at the people that are actually here. In our country, in the name of Professor Momono Jumasa, sitting here and smiling at me. And look at this online phenomenon, these personalities of the globe, these personalities in Bangladesh and also surrounding the Bangladesh. These are our idol. These are our mentors. And I will say that it's a great opportunity for any young doctors not having only the cardiology or any, any field. It's a professionalism that is bright in our future. This is the best part of it. And this is the main target, I think, for the IPDI to bring up the professionalism in all together, not only the field of any uh, particular area of cardiology or something. So that's the reason why I am really one of the part of the IPDI. The second issue is that uh, during this time of pandemic, what I like to mention that an epidemic is going on in our country in the form of non-communicable disease. I was surprised to say a few words to you that in Bangladesh, if you consider a one single risk factor, 98.3% population of Bangladesh have one risk factor of having cardiovascular disease. If you consider about three risk factor, the survey says that 29% of the population in Bangladesh is having the three or more factors. Can you imagine that? Within a sphere of the time, we can know that one third of our population is going to have some such amount of non-communicable disease, which can lead to dangers. I was amazed to see the chief guest, Professor Brigadier Malik. He's done a research in 1973, and he's saying that the hypertension was the leading cause of the non-communicable disease at that time. Now, I can give you one statement in 2018, when the step survey has been done in Bangladesh, the hypertension prevalence becomes 25.9%. Can we imagine? It's just raising it. And uh, we need to learn to do a lot of things. And there's a conception says that if you do not do research in your own country, you cannot progress. The development that has been done in Bangladesh is tremendous with the exception of the research and training. These two sections has been always in the question mark by international faculties. And this is the great initiative that has been taken by the IPDI so that we can overcome this research as well as training both. There was a many of the online research activities been done by us. But hopefully, when the vaccine will be available, we will come up to the pandemic. There will be an offline phenomenon of the training center. And I will be delighted to come to this office again and again to help you. About the research, let me give you one statement. In 2018 to 19, in the Non-Communicable Disease Center from Bangladesh, NCDC, 47 research has been done. All are big funded research. Surprisingly, only three of them published. 
So you can see that we are doing some researches that he's not giving the highlight at, at the time of the publications. And uh, look at the IPDA. They already has completed one research, even though the office has not been started. They have ongoing two research. One of them is cardiovascular. I see that in their phenomenon, and one is the cervical cancer screening. Tremendous. I would say that we'll be giving all the thoughts, all kind of support that you needed from our government side. There are phenomena how to give the research fund in our government's allocations so the NCDC program will work together. And certainly this is the fast pace that we can go forward uh, for our young doctors to come forward. Thank you very much for inviting me. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thanks for your uh, wishes for the IPDA. And uh, once I used to say that it's my bad luck that I have not been your student. But IPDA created this opportunity for me that, and uh, many more for like us to be your student. Thank you, sir. Uh, now I'd like to request Professor Choudhury Meshkat, sir, to say a few words. Professor Choudhury Meshkat, sir, is a professor of cardiology, Bangabandhu Sheikh Mujib Medical University. Thank you very much, Dr. Arif, for inviting me in IPDI program. Mr. Chairman, sir, and my respected teachers, it is rare to have both genius and the organizing capacity all together. It is also rare to have the heart and mind all together. Now we have Dr. Mohsin and Professor Wadud, who has the combination of both organizing capacity and the, and the intelligence, who has the capacity of philanthropy, which comes from the heart and the brain for organizing all these intellectual jobs. I'm so proud to be with them. And I think I would, I would love to live some more worthy years to, help, to be with them. With my, with my background career in both diabetes and cardiology, in two non-communicable diseases, I could have been of little help to them. I really pray to my almighty Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so that they live well, they, they are in good health and they do all the good for the country. We are also very fortunate to have uh, two smart guys from the government who will be taking care of the non-communicable disease. Now probably is the time when we can turn to give a big step towards a big research. Thank you very much. And I wish every success to this organization. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. Uh, you have been a great teacher for long. And you taught your student how to think cardiovascular disease from the molecular level. It's a unique characteristics of you. Uh, think we should be bring bring new window for thinking of research in IPDA. I'd like to request Dr. Kaisan Nasrullah Khan sir from United Hospital. So say a few words, Professor Dr. Kaisan Nasrullah Khan sir. Um, Assalamu alaikum and good evening to all. It's really a privilege to be uh, uh, a part of this auspicious occasion. And I would like to express the whole IPD team, especially Professor Odut Chaudhary and uh, Dr. Mohsin Ahmed, to take this uh, venture to develop the educational field of uh, Bangladesh in the field of cardiology. And, and it is a tremendous effect on the juniors of uh, cardiology in Bangladesh to learn and also sharing experience for the seniors. So uh, may Allah guide us and bless us in the righteous and ethical way to uphold the dignity and prestige of uh, cardiology in Bangladesh. Thank you all, all the best. Thank you, sir. Uh, teacher like you is uh, always wanted by youngsters like us who want to build their career in interventional cardiology. Wish you will be continue with your efforts. Now I'd like to request our Professor Khaled Mohsin, sir, Professor of Cardiology, Universal Medical College Hospital, to say a few words. Good evening. Chairperson of IPDI, Professor Abdul Wadud Choudhury, Secretary General, Dr. Mohsin Ahmad, Chief Guest, Guests of Honor, Special Guests, good evening to you all. And it is a really amazing journey of IPDI 
and it started from its inception as a organizer of webinar activity and culminating in uh, the very beautiful uh, inauguration ceremony of a very beautiful office in less than a year time. It is a, it's a really amazing experience and I am very much proud and honored to be associated with IPDI as a co-chairperson and it is uh, possible The chairperson, the secretary general, and all of you, uh, and with your uh, dynamic support and participation, uh, this has become possible. And it has reached, uh, it's uh, spread beyond the borders of this country, and it has become a really an inter organization with an international acceptance and international. Uh, reputation and with inauguration of this uh, office I think it will uh, be stepping in the arena of the integrated research and uh, in the publication in the different disciplines of cardio of medicine which uh, predominantly encompasses the cardiology and it has uh, we hope that you will be with us during its auspicious journey uh, uh, in, to the peak of excellence. And thank you very much for your presence and participation. And uh, long live IPDI and uh, long live our uh, association with this very dynamic and uh, prospective organization. Thank you very much. Thank you, sir. You have been a great teacher for long, but we were unfortunate to get you during our student period. But IPDI virtual school gave us this opportunity, and you are a teacher in the IPDI virtual school. And I'd like to request Dr. A.K. Monod Islam, sir. Uh, we are blessed to get his touch in our student life, and he basically is a, is a trainer of teachers. I must say he's a trainer of teachers. So please say a few words. Assalamu alaikum. Thank you very much. Uh, I think this is a red letter day for us because beyond our day to day uh, normal uh, doings, we are doing something special for the future. Uh, I personally felt lack of this aspect among especially the cardiologists and beyond also the other professionals that we need to develop our professionalism. And for this, we have to know, we have to and get trained and then we have to exercise we, what we have learned and this is a continuous process and for this season what IPDI is going uh, is going to start and what has already done by this organization is uh, uh, really amazing but uh, there is no point of uh, uh, satisfaction and I think uh, it's a long way to go in future and uh, everything will tell uh, what we are going to do in future our jobs our deeds will uh, uh, evaluate us and i will be really happy to be with this organization and do uh, what we should do thank you all thank you sir thanks a lot for your valuable comments I'd like to request Dr. Khizir Hayat Khan, Director Admin, SIBL Foundation, to come forward and say a few words. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim. I express my deepest gratitude to Almighty Allah for enabling me to be here with you in such an auspicious occasion. And I'm grateful to the organizers of this uh, IPDI Resource and Training Center inaugural ceremony for inviting me and to give me an opportunity to say a few words in front of you. As a matter of fact, I got introduced with this, uh, with this really very valuable organizers, some probably one or two months earlier when they first arrived here and they were seeking an office. 
And fortunately, one of our advisors, uh, Dr. Tanvir Ahmed, and he uh, collaborated with these organizers. And subsequently, we came to the decision that this office will be established here. And I was really happy to accommodate these good organizers here and to the effect that when I told that with the, with the advent of this office to be established here in, in these premises, both of us will be benefited and the benefit will be bilateral because we, we are long, we are long since we are just wanting to have a, a, a CCU established in this hospital. And you know, those who are organizing this IPDI, they are really very, very experienced. And I am really grateful to them that they have already uh, commented that very soon we will be able to establish a CCU in this hospital. And together we will work for the suffering humanity. This evening was really very, 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 I should say that very uh, amazing event for this hospital because this is the first time we are going to host such a very good organizer and such a very good organization which will be working for the suffering humanity. And in future, I hope the more and more um, skilled professionals will be developed and they will be working for the development of our country. Our previous speakers, they told that without being professional, we cannot prosper. So I, I find that in future, this organization will develop further. And once again, I thank the organizers for inviting me to say a few words in front of you. Thank you very much. And I wish a very good success for this organization. Thank you all. Salaamu Alaikum. Uh, thank you, sir. Mm, IPDA will be always remember your name because your contribution in establishing this office is very crucial in our IPDA establishment. Your generous support will be always remembered. Thank you, sir. Uh, now I'd like to request a very special guest, uh, Mr. Advocate Abu Raja MD Kayum Khan, who is the president, honorable president of Healthy Heart Happy Life Organization. Uh, Healthy Heart Happy Life Organization is basically, basically is the, uh, who incepted and concept the IPDA and ultimately give birth to IPDA. Please, sir. Bismillahir Rahman Rahim. Achkere Udbudin Unustaner Shamanito Shawaputi, Professor Odu Choduri Ebong Achker A Unustaner Shamanito Prodano Titi Jatio Adapok Brigadier Shurprap to Malik Ebong Unan Bishesho Titi Ebong Jaratske Pustitatsen Aslamu Alaikum. After Janin Che Healthy Life, Healthy Heart Happy Life Organization, Hello, Ekti Ambeshar Kari Shonstha Jeta Awareness Charity and Research for Humanity, a slogan near Duhajar Ataro Shalet, January Kashuru Kodetse, Amra Kashuru Korapore Loko Kodetse, Amadir Bivino Sectory Amra Unnoin Kote Pedetsik into প্রশিক্ষণ এবং গবেষণা এই দুটি সেক্টরে আমরা পিছিয়ে আছি বাংলাদেশের পার্সপেক্টিভে বলছি তখন আমাদের যে ফাউন্ডার ডক্টর মাহসিন তাকে নিয়ে আমরা চিন্তা করেছি যে কিভাবে এই আমাদের দেশের যারা পেশাজীবী আছেন তাদেরকে আরো ভালোভাবে প্রশিক্ষিত করা যায় এবং ডক্টর মাহসিন এই দায়িত্ব নিয়েছেন এবং আমাদের at a sister concern, Shebe IPDI Tar Kardio Krom Shuru Kodate Ebong Ami, Dr. Mohsin Ebong, Professor Odud Chodur Kate Kito Gota Gapon Kurse Amar Shangotoner Pakodeke Tara a Guru Daito Nietzen Ebong Duhajar Bish Shaler Marche Kat Shuru Kore Agbosher Komshumai Atske Ti Shundur uh, office Bhavon Amra PHC, Jekane Agamidin Richard Sevong training card Jokrom Cholbe. So Ami Amar Shangotane Pakoteke, Tadeke, Donova Janatsi, Mami Asha Kurboje, Akon Pud Amnejotuk, Jenetsi, J. Ridro, Bishoy, Amrakas Kodetsi, among Agamite, uh, Cancer Rupode, Proshikone, Kardjokrom Chalo Kurtejatse. I mean, Ashakurboje, IPDI, 
তার কার্যক্রমের মাধ্যমে এ দেশের আরো ভালো পেশাজীবী ডক্টর এবং অন্যান্য পেশারও যারা আছেন তাদেরকে ট্রেনিং এর মাধ্যমে আরো উপযুক্ত করে তুলবেন আমি আইপিডি এর সাফল্য কামনা করছি এবং সকলকে ধন্যবাদ জানাচ্ছি আসসালামু আলাইকুম থ্যাংক ইউ স্যার থ্যাংক ইউ ফর ওয়ার্ডস ইউ উইল বি ডিলাইটেড টু হিয়ার দ্যাট দ্যাট आवर फर्स्ट রিসার্চ दैट हैव ऑलरेडी कंप्लीटेड इट इज नॉट ओनली कंट्रीब्यूटेड बाय डॉक्टर्स is greatly contributed by their hello uh, members and then mostly non medical person and their uh, contribution will be greatly acknowledged by ipdi in the near future as always now we are in such a moment uh, because this office is basically built for the youngsters who will be working here we will be now hearing from a uh, few uh, members from them from the which will be use this office properly now i would like to request major dr uh, farzana shathi from combined military hospital to say few words major shathi please come here honorable guest assalamu alaikum i am major jinat from cms dhaka uh it's a great opportunity to present here and i like to thanks especially ipti um everybody and to to get opportunity to um to get opportunity uh, and to achieve training from IPTI and thanks again assalamu alaikum thank you major jinat now i would like to request dr aisha kader assistant professor ibrahim kadek hospital and research institute to say few words dr aisha kader thank you arish bhai uh, so i wasn't expecting to speak but anyway congratulations to uh, professor adud sir and uh, dr mohsin sir and everyone involved in ipdi this is a very unique project because it's uh, by the current generation for the future generation and we as the younger generation we are very grateful for this opportunity and i have realized over the last year how much we are lagging in terms of research and it's something that i have discussed with arif bhai many times also that this is something we need to work on for the future and it's fabulous that there is a platform that we can build on as the younger generation to work on this forward so thank you so much for creating this for us and uh, i wish you all the very best thank you sir thank you aisha to manage your time to come here Now I'd like to request Dr. Kudrati Khuda Babu from NICBD to say favors. Please come here. Uh, thank you, Dr. Ari, for giving me the opportunity to speak something in front of my very learned and respected teachers. <clears throat> uh first i would like to say that this this has been a great initiative ipd ipdi and basically this was a dream like us to get all the professors uh, at a single desk for a single topic and now uh is i'm very happy to see that it's expanding like uh very in a very good manner and fashion and uh, i wish all the best for this uh for this uh, ipdi and i i would like to request all uh, young cardiologists uh, like us or more young cardiologists to join here and to expand their activity of ipdi thank you thank you all thank you dr kudruti kota babu for your valuable comments now i'd like to request dr moti rahman to come up on dais and say few words Assalamu alaikum 
আইপিডি এর আজকের এই উদ্বোধনী অনুষ্ঠানে সত্যি নিজেকে গর্বিত ফিল করছি এবং আমরা অনেক আগে থেকে ফিল করছিলাম যে এরকম একটা আমাদের রিসার্চ এবং ট্রেনিং সেন্টার দরকার আমার প্রিয় দুজন শিক্ষক আব্দুল বাদু চৌধুরী এবং মহসিন আহমদ স্যারের তত্ত্বাবধানে আজকে এই আইপিডি এর উদ্বোধন হচ্ছে এই জন্য সত্যি গর্বিত ফিল করছি এবং আমরা আইপিডি এর সাথে থাকব এবং আইপিডি এর সাথে থেকে নিজেদের প্রফেশনাল ডেভেলপমেন্ট অ্যাজ ওয়েল অ্যাজ রিসার্চ ওয়ার্কে নিজেদেরকে নিবেদিত করতে পারব এই আশাই ব্যক্ত করছি সবাইকে অসংখ্য ধন্যবাদ থ্যাংক ইউ ডক্টর মতিউর আই লাইক টু রিকোয়েস্ট ডক্টর চয়ন কুমার সিং হ্যাঁ ফ্রম বঙ্গবন্ধু শেখ মুজিব মেডিকেল ইউনিভার্সিটি টু সে ফিওয়ার্স ধন্যবাদ আরিফ ভাই সবাইকে শুভ সন্ধ্যা আসলে মর্নিং শুজ দা ডেজ যখন আইপিডি আই যাত্রা শুরু হয়েছিল গত বছর জানুয়ারিতে তখনই আমরা বুঝেছিলাম কিছু একটা হবে আমাদের দেশে আমাদের শ্রদ্ধেয় দুইজন স্যারের আছেন মহসিন স্যার এবং ওয়াদুদ স্যার ওনাদের হাত ধরে পথ চলা এবং আমরা আইপিডি আইয়ের সাথে আছি ও রবিদামিন স্যার বলছে আসলে রিসার্চ না হলে আমরা চাই যে আমাদের প্রতিটা কার্ডিওলজিক্যাল পার্সপেকটিভে আমাদের নিজস্ব একটা গাইডলাইন থাকুক লাইক হাইপার টেনশন হার্ট ফেলুর প্রতিটা অ্যাসপেক্টে আর কি আমাদের যেমন টিভির গাইডলাইন অনেক সুন্দর আমরা চাই যে এরকম কার্ডিওলজির এবং অন্যান্য সাবজেক্টের ক্ষেত্রে প্রতিটা সুন্দর সুন্দর গাইডলাইন আমাদের নিজস্ব গাইডলাইন থাকুক আমরা যেমন ইউরোপিয়ান গাইডকে ফলো করি বা আমেরিকান আহা গাইডলাইনকে ফলো করি আমরা চাই যে আমাদের আইপিডি আইয়ের হাত ধরে এমন কিছু গাইডলাইন ক্রিয়েটেড হোক যে ওয়ার্ল্ডের প্রতিটা মানুষ মানে আমাদেরকে ফলো করবে আর কি তো থ্যাংক ইউ ভেরি মাছ সবাইকে ধন্যবাদ thank you dr joyan singh uh, you will be delighted to know that uh, we already uh, developed a hypertension manual for brac it is a uh, sub formally like this not officially but they took help uh, from us and we are delighted to contribute them and it is uh, already in the press now so very soon will be in, it will be in our hand and i'd like to request uh, dr asif zaman tusar who is electrophysiologist from national institute of cardiovascular diseases thank you sir thank you all the respected uh, members of ipdi as uh, mohsin ahmed sir also said about dream what i also say is that in bangladesh now we have plenty of abundance of uh, resource what we do not have is that thinking and eagerness to research only these two thing can shift Bangladesh from a developing country to a developed country to a follower country to a country to be followed we are not here to be a country which always see guidelines from american heart association it is our desire that we will create a guideline bangladesh guideline that will be followed by america and this is our desire and we hope some day it will come true thank you all uh, thank you dr tushar actually uh, uh, all of us think like this but we have to come into the field we have to give our efforts and sincere efforts there is no chance of escape in the middle of the work thank you now i'd like to request dr sakif sharia from national institute of cardiovascular diseases to say a few words Assalamu alaikum. It is a great honor for me to uh, present and uh, in front of uh, all of my respected teachers. And I must congratulate uh, IPDI and the platform uh, to uh, integrate such a nice uh, office and a nice uh, platform that will help uh, our uh, future research and training institute. And um, from the beginning of uh, January last year, um, yeah. professor mohsin sir uh, um, called me to give a lecture on that and uh, from then and i uh, i have um, uh, professor wadu chaudhary sir is my direct teacher uh, during my md period and uh, hopefully with uh, all their effort and all their sincere effort we will go forward uh, in the um, skill development and also in research thank you thank you so much 
thank you, Sakif. Uh, your uh, voice will be our spirit. And I'd like to request Dr. Monjur uh, from City Medical College, Khulna. He took a long journey from Khulna to join our uh, integration session. Dr. Monjur, please. Thank you. Thank you and assalamu alaikum and very good evening to the um, my respected teachers and uh, fellows. Actually, what uh, IPDI can do, that is what uh, already we know in the last one year, especially who are uh, work outside Dhaka city, we get enough benefit from this uh, platform. And I also, I would like to thank also Afzal Rahman sir because of uh, to create such kind of uh, uh, platform by showing uh, IPDS, like, like he first uh, created the platform BIT, then now IPDI. Uh, these things are just a continuation, I think, and special thanks to Mohsin sir and uh, Wadu sir, uh, especially for, uh, this is especially helping us, those, those who are uh, working outside Dhaka city. And I, I like to uh, thank everybody who uh, uh, organized this program and organized this uh, platform. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Dr. Monjur. And I'd like to request to come for Dr. Tanvir Ahmed. Uh, he is a, uh, not only a cardiologist, but I rather say is a health entrepreneur. And, and he did a lot to establish this our station and we'll hear from him. Thank you. First, I would like to thank uh, Mohsin sir and Wadud sir uh, for taking the initiative. It's, uh, it's actually less than one year when they took the initiative. Uh, we are hopeful in the beginning that it will be a great prospect, but today's program and uh, all the activities during this pandemic uh, has assured us that it will definitely be a big uh, uh, big outcome, not only for the nation, but it will cross the boundaries as well, because all of you, sir, my teachers, the advisory board, the, all the teachers who have participated physically and virtually, they in fact are very busy persons. And when they are giving time for this initiative, definitely everyone is thinking this definitely has lots of potential to uh, help our uh, people like me people like me definitely and all others who are interested in participating in building the healthcare facilities in the country. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Um, thank you, Dr. Tanvir. Uh, we are here to celebrate the day, but also uh, a, uh, also uh, we have to uh, plan a green a blue look for our future where we will uh, try to make success to her every dream. Now I'd like to th uh, come for Dr. Mohsin Ahmed sir for a word of thanks. Mohsin Ahmed sir, please. Uh, thank you, we are passing uh, around two hours time. Our foreign faculty, Dr. Professor Imas Sivan, also with us two hours. So, so much encouraging for me, especially uh, everybody other two names, Professor Wadud and Professor Mohsin. I think it is not said uh, it is a teamwork. I think uh, I dream to do something. Professor Wadud is a, my mentor. He's a, uh, always a very good chemistry, I think so. In the Dhaka Medical College, I doing lots of job there. But I think it's teamwork. I think Professor Khalid Mohsin sir, Professor Meshkat Ahmed Choudhury, Professor Kaisa Nusrullah Khan, Dr. Uh, Manwar, Dr. Arif Rahman, Arif Rahman, Dr. Tanbi, Dr. Motiur, also you people or the young guys always helping a lot. I especially thank Dr. Um, hello, my friends. I am so lucky. I have a good friend. I think we are uh, we are till now we are enjoying our night with 30, 40 school friends. You imagine, Dr. Uh, Advocate uh, Kayum, Tipu, Tuhin, Jahid. Uh, he is the director. Jahid, Jahid. All, all our good friends who do a lot of good thing. I uh, can uh, so thank hello and I I especially thank uh, our Brigadier Malik sir and uh, our special guest, Attorney General M. Aminuddin. He is the advisor of Hello. And Konak Kanti Bodhwa, sir, he's a busy schedule here. At the age of uh, this year, he's take risk in coming here. And our uh, Professor Mojimdas, Abdullah Shabi Mundar, Professor K. Mohibullah, sir, Professor Mohamed Jaman, still is hearing our uh, lecture. Um, yeah. 
also uh, i especially thank uh, pharmaceutical companies i especially to come beximco to respond in this response in this program last covid pandemic last 8 to 9 months beximco and incepta pharmaceutical is doing a lot of job with me because i also sleep 3 to 4 hours at night also beximco and incepta sleep of uh, not not not, uh, not sleeping at well at night yesterday also i at 2 o'clock i dr mr kamrul work with me at 2 o'clock in midnight so i really thank incepta from uh, beximco and uh, cloud markong markong uh, i think uh, shaun and his team arafat shaun he's there so professional i see lots of professionalism uh, media and uh, moshed the interior design and everything did by, by the cloud markong they also our third party they always uh, i think we are uh, we are thinking about the professionalism so we are not dependent on the on the pharmaceutical company we prepared our slides presentation by ourselves so we give the third party support i think we can going coming forwards uh, i especially thank uh, i uh, also i uh, thank our executives uh, shahzad selim he and our dr shibli uh, shibli sahib he are pointing uh, to a staff executives they are doing a tremendous job last covid pandemic also our another press um, uh, journalist junaid shishit working with me uh, thanks everybody especially also thank uh, our uh, my chairman professor abdul adil choudhury uh, he did a lot for last one year with me thanks everybody uh thanks oh, uh a list i thank sibl foundation uh, they give you the opportunity to building a uh, official i think uh, we are here long time uh, tanvir or oh, thank tanvir i think thanks everybody thanks good night thank everybody assalamu alaikum Thank you all. Uh, your presence is always inspiring for us. And I'd like to request Professor Abdul Wahid Choudhury, sir, for the closing remarks, sir. I don't know what to say. I was really overwhelmed by the physical presence, the by the virtual presence, the word of encouragement. the active participation by everybody we are spending almost 2 hours and still so many of you are with us thank you so much but as someone was saying we can only start robi dakur bolechilen amra shuru kori shesh kori na we have to continue we have to be persistent and we have to produce this is going to be a training center and a research center what we are intending to do to help the young stars to provide a framework of ideological and logistical and a place to think widely out of the box new things that will not only enhance their skill and knowledge and professionalism but also will advance the healthcare of this country to this end we started ipdi and mosin is a jewel he is the energy horse he is the main pillar of this organization and the youngsters like arif tanfir motiur and so many of you all of you are contributing you are our source of inspiration i hope we will achieve something in future we will celebrate after a year what we have done throughout the next year to that end to that future let us work together thank you and good night assalam alaikum thank you sir thank you all for joining with us in person and virtually thank you good night